Theosis and the Church What a great blessing that we commune through the Immaculate Mysteries. Christ becomes ours. The life of Christ becomes ours. His blood becomes our blood. St. John Chrysostom says that God has nothing more to give man than what he gives him in Holy Communion. Man cannot ask anything more of God than what he receives from Christ in Holy Communion. So, being baptized, chrismated, confessing, we commune through the body and blood of the Lord, and we too become gods by grace. We unite with God. We are no longer strangers, for we have become familiar with God. Inside the church in which we unite with God, we live this new reality which Christ brought to the world, the new creation. This is the life of the church, of Christ which becomes ours as a gift from the Holy Spirit. Everything in the church leads to theosis, the holy liturgy, the mysteries, divine worship, the gospel sermon, the fasting. All of these lead to this one thing. The church alone is the place of theosis. The church is not a social, cultural, or historical organization and does not resemble other organizations in the world. It is not like the different establishments of the world. The world has fine institutions, fine organizations, fine establishments, and other fine things, but our Orthodox Church is the unrepeatable, the sole place of the communion of God with man, for the theosis of man. Only within the Church can man become a God, and nowhere else, not in universities, not in social services, not in any of the fine and good things that the world has. None of these are able to offer what the church offers, however good they may be. No matter how much worldly institutions and systems progress, they can never replace the church. It is possible that we weak and sinful men go through crises and difficulties from time to time within the church. It is possible for scandals to happen in the bosom of the church. All these happen in the church because we are as yet on the way to theosis, and it is very natural that human weaknesses still exist. We are becoming gods, but not yet. So no matter how often these things occur, we will not leave the church, because within the church we have the only possibility to unite with God. 